It's a celestial visitor that hasn't passed through these parts since Neanderthals walked the Earth. You're seeing something nobody has seen for 47, 48,000 years when our ancestors may have said, wow. The bright green comet with the funny name. The name of the comet is C-2022 E3 ZTF. Dan Bartlett is a retired high school science teacher. He didn't discover the comet, but he's taken some of its most spectacular images, including this one that caught the attention of NASA. Hi all, Dan Bartlett coming to you from beautiful June Lake, California. From his cabin near Yosemite National Park, Bartlett trains his highly specialized telescope cameras into the clear night sky, capturing comets like this one in 2020. I think the excitement is, what am I going to get next? He first photographed this latest comet July 4th. And right here is the first inkling of the comet, right here. There's not much to, to see, but it's beautiful. As the comet got closer, the pictures got better. October, November, and this image taken Christmas Day. Yeah, I live for this stuff. I shoot the uh, images, and I don't know what I'm going to see from the month before. And you realize... The insignificance that we are when we look out into the depths of reality. NASA says the comet will reach its closest point to the sun Thursday, then swing by Earth a mere 26 million miles away on February 1st. You should be able to spot it in early morning. If you want to see it, binoculars, that's all you need. These are unpredictable. They could fizzle out. It could break up. It could get so hot. It could get significantly brighter. We just don't know. So this is... We're excited. I'm excited. The comet was just discovered last March, but this will be the last chance to see it. Once it leaves the solar system, Bartlett says, it's gone for good. Clayton Sandell, Scripps News.